Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you what settings need to be enabled in Thinkorswim so that your platform is set up properly for day trading. The very first setting we're going to enable is at the login window, and you'll see this little gear icon on the bottom left. So we're going to click that and then we're going to have memory usage. Mine is set to 32 all the way to 6144. Now you're going to want to set it to this if you have a pretty decent computer. Usually if you're running at least 16 gigabytes of memory, then this is what it should be enabled to. If you're running anything lower, then you could step it down to 3072. Basically what this is doing is letting Thinkorswim use more computing power to run more smoothly. Once we're logged in, we're going to go to Setup, Application Settings, and then System. For Quote Speed, make sure it's set to Real Time No Delay. By default, it's usually set to Moderate or Fast, but for Day Trading, it needs to be set to Real Time. What we're going to do next is go all the way over to the right and click Active Trader, Time and Sales. Then we're going to come up to Setup, Application Settings, and then go to Active Trader. For AT order submission rate limit, set that to zero. Then on the actual active trader window, make sure auto send is checked. Now we're able to send multiple orders every time we click buy or sell. This creates one order, but I can click it now five more times. And now we have six orders set. Right here, I can click the little X and cancel them all. I hope you found this video helpful, especially if you're a new trader getting into day trading. In the future, I'll be releasing videos showing different patterns to trade off of and how to identify them. Other than that, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.